<laughs> What's up, y'all? This is Mel. Thank you. Keish. Welcome back to it's a, a walk in the fat woman's shoes. Oh, wow. Tonight we eating hot dogs. We drinking on that good old H2O. The girl is not here, but she will do what? Nothing. She will save you in a crisis. Yes, she will. Yes, she will. How to get a big girl, a big small, a big baby, or even a male baby. What be in the description box below. So you gonna click that link. You gonna get yourself one. You order to yourself. All those won't do it. Good. God, this is Amen. Amen. So what's going on with you guys tonight? Let us know what y'all eating and if y'all eating with us. Also, let us know what's going on in y'all negative words, how you were drinking, and what y'all did today. Y'all not want to know I'm nosy. I'm nosy. Y'all know I'm nosy. Uh, I hope y'all hear me or whatever because uh, I just knocked the mic. And, uh, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I just pour my water in my cup. Hell, miss. If I could get it open. Open here. There we go. I guess not. Please. That one did it. Hopefully that will melt. It's going to melt. It's going to melt. Why you left the tongues over there like that? <laughs> Y'all, today, today, was a day. Where did we go today, baby? Where you wanted to go? Give me that cheese. I took my baby to La Calais Dose. La Calais Dose. La Calais Dose. La Calais Dose. Right? And because I didn't take her to the one she wanted to go to, what she did? If y'all know us, y'all know what she did. What did I do? She complained. No, I didn't. Stop lying on me. You didn't complain? No. Okay, so who was that saying? Oh, it's nice, but why we didn't go to the other one? That's not complaining. That's complaining to me because I tried. Did you? Give me that mustard, please. I tried. And. She was telling me about why I no, didn't why bring her didn't... to the other one. Why I didn't bring her to the other one. But at the same time, I just picked one. It was just a random pick. I didn't think she really had no specific one to want to go to. I thought she would have, you know, just been straight with just going there, you know. You know. Me personally, it, I wasn't impressed, but it, it was what it was. You know, it was nice for what it was, but I was not impressed. You know, I I say that. Okay, then. Can I interrupt your eating for a Go second? Ahead. All right. Okay. I need you to close your eyes for this one. What? Mm-hmm. Close your eyes right quick. I ain't going to put nothing in your food or nothing like that. Oh, I ain't worried about that. Imagine. There's this beautiful hotel. It sits on a lake, right? Mm-hmm. 
nice shimmering water, and that's just where you want to go, right? Mm -hmm. So, I blindfold you, and I put you in the car, and I'm like, <laughs> B, when we get where we going, I hope you, like, really like it, or, or whatever, whatever, but it's a surprise. So, we get to the hotel, you know, we, your Can eyes, you you're you blindfolded, really stop, shut right. up, you're blindfolded, so we get to the hotel, you're blindfolded and whatever, whatever. Now, I be like, babe, we got a, 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 you know, waterside view. And you like, yeah. And when you open your eyes, it ain't nothing but swamp. How would you like that? What you mean, swamp? No, you got, no. See, you can't just say swamp. It ain't no. You can't just say swamp. Okay, then it's just not what moss I water. It's not what I no, want. No, no, it's just a pool of marsh water. So you're saying where I took you, I was just a That's swamp. not what I asked you. I we, wouldn't like it, but unlike you, I wouldn't complain to you about what it. Did I, how did I complain? I wouldn't say, oh, well, I didn't want to go here. I don't want to go to the other one. I wouldn't have did that. So you would have been happy with your marsh prime you water. You know why I would have been happy about it? Because you lied. Because you brought me. Because you lied. Oh, stop. You know me. And I don't know why you play me like that. Because you lying. Yeah, right. You know me. I don't know I why you play me like that. Because you know, by you bring you bringing me there, I'd have still been a preacher. Okay, what if I just leave you there? Would you be a preacher? You wouldn't. If? I left you. Did I leave That's you? not what I asked you. And if I left you, know you there, you would you be a preacher too? Hell no, not if you'd have left me. Not, uh-uh, fly. No, see, we ain't doing this tonight. I wouldn't have been appreciative if she'd have left me. Fuck no, hell no. Well, well, hell, y'all talk, y'all talk all that shit. I'm not gonna say. Who'd have been appreciative if you'd have got left at that type of place? Come but on, this now. Is what you always wanted, a room side with a water view. A room with a water view. <laughs> you know. You know what? Nothing. Give me, uh, you, you use the spoon? I used it, oh, well, right here, just clean it. I used it to cut my hot dog. Okay, then how about this? Yeah, I tell stop you, with the scenarios, baby. Just stop with the scenarios. So if I, I, bring, if I tell you you're going to the nail up, shop and I bring you to the dog room, how would you feel? Oh, I'd be pissed off. I'd but be pissed off man. because I don't like dogs. And I feel like you telling me, you <laughs> calling me a fucking dog. I'd be pissed. I ain't gonna lie. I would be very much pissed. Pissed off to the eyes of festivity. Okay, that's like you saying you always wanted to go to Germany. And we get on the plane and fly to Germany, Pennsylvania. Is, are you gonna be happy? Is it Germany? Pennsylvania. Is it Germany? It's Pennsylvania. Yeah, it don't matter. Now you gonna sit there with that lie. I'd be upset. I ain't gonna lie. I would be upset. But damn. See, that's the pro mm, that's the difference between me and you. I'm a preacher. Though. I don't complain. How I complain? Did you, you just said what? Basically, you just compared to what I told you. How did I complain? Babe, you just compared. You saying I complain, but I don't recall me complaining. To the, I should have took you on 12th Street. I just told you that this is not the where I wanted to go. And you don't think that's complaining? Okay, so what if I did you that? I would have accepted it and I would have been like, okay. What are you looking at me like Girl. that for? Okay. Okay. You just compared where I brought you to a swamp. No, I didn't. I said, imagine if you wanted to go to this hotel that had beautiful no, lake go. views. No, let me go. You that already. That had beautiful lake views, and you can see the yachts on the water. You know, you can see the boats going up and down and shit. But I brought you somewhere that got a marsh pond. How would you feel? I'd be upset, but guess what? 
I feel like you could evidently you couldn't afford my dream where I wanted to go. So So I'm supposed to feel that way about where you took me? No, I didn't say that. I ain't say that because after the four well I took you. Even though I was not impressed. Me personally, I think the soup was the best thing on the table for me. It was nice. It was nice. I ain't gonna lie. In in there, the ambiance beautiful. Only thing me personally, I think was missing out of them. There was no. You couldn't smell the food. You couldn't smell no food cooking. None at all. And it's like they just used bell pepper onion no garlic and i guess no seasoning because a lot of it was you know the, you know now cheese has its own sauce so cheese gonna be good but you think so all that other stuff mm -mm. they had no seasoning but would i go there again i don't know i don't know i don't i don't know Bro, oh come on, Bacon, You pause, Jake. Oh, I ain't trying to get no copyright. Hold on. Sorry about that, y'all. Had that cell phone call. You just could not smell no food enough. But when we came out, you could smell food. The place next door. You could smell their food. It smelled like steak. Whatever. Smell like grilled food, you know. And that's a uh what was sports ball? Something like that. But I said I'm I'm going over there. I'm going over there. Cause when I looked at it, they have burgers and you can add you can get your burger however you want. So if you don't want no bun, you can get it like that. You know? But I had, um, like when you first go in that place, you know, it's really nice. Like I say, it's really nice and it smells clean, clean, clean. You hear me? And, um, the, the tables are nice and stuff like that. And, uh, as soon as you get, as soon as you sit down, they give you tortillas. They give you tortillas and butter. Didn't mess with that. They gave, then, right after that, instead of, you know, trying to see if you're going to even eat the tortillas, they come with tortilla chips and two different sauces, a mild one and a hot, a mild one and a spicy one. I did. The spicy. Hmm? The red one. But they were just loose. They wasn't, I did try them. But they was not, you know. It wasn't sticking to the chip, you know. I was looking for it to stick to the chip. And I ain't gonna lie, that made me want guacamole, but we didn't get it. But I did order um this stuff called what was it? Something Cancun. Fondue. Fondue Cancun, right? It was cheese with seafood in it. And it was so good oh my god it was so good then for um my entree i ordered a paella but i ate so much of that and drunk the soup that when my paella came i couldn't really eat it but i was trying to the smoked sausage in there was really really good i i, I swear it was really good i don't know what that smoked sausage was but it was good and and the fish but once i saw all those thick pieces of chicken and then there were chicken breasts I don't eat chicken breasts I don't eat chicken I love chicken but I don't eat chicken breasts and when I saw all that I'm like mm -mm, I can't do it can't do it somebody ordered well my baby ordered some what kind of enchiladas was it it is enchiladas uh, shrimp enchiladas. How about that? Okay. Shrimp enchiladas. Hers is good. She had me taste you like you guys taste so I tasted it and it was really good. 
the rice. Mm. Right. The paella rice was good. You know. But it just, you know, all that chicken. And then it was dry. And not seasoned. Not seasoned at all. So, I was like, I guess there's a lost cold. But uh, before that, she had got some oysters. What did you do with darts? Something bad. Sure did. Yeah, my baby a full snot, but you know. It is what it is. If you a full snot. Live in Dallas. Shit, I probably could say Texas. And you've been to a fiesta when it just didn't smell right. In the seafood department, that's how them oysters hit me. So I have something back. Because I already was skeptical. Because I was looking at them. And I was like, well, Mel, don't, don't judge a book by its cover. <laughs> Excuse me. And you know, that book should have been judged by its cover. Yeah. I don't even think if they would have steamed those, I would have ate them. Right. So now I know, even though they're not the best place for now, my oysters got to come from Juicy crab. The juicy crab. Right. I ain't gonna lie. Now they have some good ursus. Juicy crab ursus is so good. I mean, I, I don't know nobody playing with dude. I don't know nobody messing with the ursus. But. She said she done. I'll go back with you, babe. I mean, if you going back, I'll go back with you. It's not a it's not a big thing. But Take her out. One, for me to take her out, I can't surprise her. I have to let her know. Look, hey bitch, I'm taking you such and such. You tell me which one you want to go to. I've been telling you for five years. That's why I'm so fucked. That's why I thought that was. I'm so serious. I thought that's what that was. You know I didn't know no damn Lacalle those men 12 Street. I literally showed you the one I wanted to go to. I was right there with week. you when I saw it. Did that look like a beautiful blue house? Nope. So how could that be where I wanted to go? Mm -mm. What you mean? It was a beautiful it was a beautiful restaurant, but no, it didn't look like a beautiful blue house. I wanted to go to the original, the creator, the number one. Because when you, when you start doing all them other things, you get sloppy. I just wanted to go to the first one. And I thought that one was on Spielman. No. Listen to the name. La Kelly Dulce. That means 12th Street. See, just do a little research. Just a little. And the La Calle Dose I wanted to go to is on 12th Street. I showed her. Was that you I showed the house to? I was with you when we saw the house together. And you thought that was on skill me? Yeah, I, I wasn't, at the time, I wasn't looking in no street. I was just looking around.
But we was by the courthouse. They got a courthouse over there on Skillman. <laughs> oh, uh, what you do with that spoon? Not, never just for the, give um, it back. Yeah, I don't like enjoy like. So I'm guessing, like there, right there, was like meeting your hero and men disappearing. To that one. Well, I can't really say that because I met his little brother. But, but I, don't, I don't understand it. Now I know. My my son said my Mexican food is off the chain because it has flavor. Like my son told me. I make enchiladas better than his friend mama. And I'm like, what? I say, you sure? He was like, yeah. I told my friend, next time you make enchiladas, I'm going to have to give him a plate. Excuse me, y'all. That was my son again. This time he had to get in touch with me. Right. I just wish she would have told him, hey son, we doing a video. Uh like that would have made a difference. He wouldn't have called back. He would have just waited till he got home to tell us what he had to say. Yeah. Might but have I been a twenty minute conversation, but he had to wait. Now go ahead. Me personally, I'm taking myself to Fogo du Tribe. I'm taking myself there because I, for? I don't know. I don't know. Now you're looking like that at me. Because I'm going to have the experience. You say, I can't eat that. I can't eat like that. But fuck that. All you got to do is turn your damn thing upside down. You know, you eat your, you eat your little one piece of meat and turn it over. There you go. But I, I, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. I am going, I'm going to have that experience myself. And I think I'm going to take that because I wanted to take um, I I wanted to tape our um, thing to the machine woman to tape it, so I didn't, you know. I didn't tell you that. You just tell you just saying you ain't tell me nothing, nothing, nothing to do, huh? I just it's thought that would have been rude to pull out your camera and record. Was you know, it nobody, boss? Who, them hackling people. Them golden girls was right there, but them golden girls wouldn't have watched up, wouldn't they? Look, look, the way I done had the angle of it is just me and you. Them people wouldn't have been in that. And then they have nobody behind us till we was getting ready to leave. Uh-uh, when we first got there, they had people behind us. I didn't see nobody behind us. Because your back was to them, but I could see them. Mm. Man. But I know I, when I go to Fogo du Child, I'm going to, I'm going to sit and I'm going to have my experience and I'm going to tape it. Or I'm going to go live, you know, and stuff, you know, I guess y'all experience it with me or whatever. Yeah, I am doing that. I ate three 
I know. I am stuffed like a mother. Hmm. I was supposed to eat four. You know, even numbers. I'll eat it. I'll eat it tomorrow. I'll, I guess I'll eat three tomorrow. I don't know. Girl, you making no sense. Ah, uh, that's not even number. You know how I feel about that. Yeah, uh, yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna eat three tomorrow, though. Open it. Then again, tomorrow's a whole new day. So. What's tomorrow? Thursday. Why do they always make my appointments on Thursdays? I don't know. Shitty. I be. Because they know I like to go up there on Fridays. I don't think it got nothing to do with you. I know. I know, I'm just saying. I, uh. Friday, they don't never give me no Friday appointment. Oh, wait, I had yeah. one Friday appointment. But was it with them? I don't think so. I think it was when you, uh, when you had, you know, when you No, I think it was with it. them. Remember, and it was like at 3 o'clock and it was pushing me out the damn door? No, nah, that was with your finger. No. They, I'm, okay, um, all right. Because I told you they get off at four. So. I have a question. Ugh. You say you know me, right? Mm-hmm. Well. Yeah, I know. If I knew you, I knew you wanted to go to the little blue house and on 12th Street. I didn't know all that, all that. I know that. No. No. Barely at all. <laughs> what is it? I thought playing it would be better. I, I just came. I shouldn't do this to you. I should have just bought them in the mall and put them in the pot and call mm -hmm. it again. But, um... If you know me, you would not have tried to... Surprise you? Do something nice for you? Have a well, loving day with you? You know, I don't get down on that side of town. <laughs> That's by, the, by the, the whole food we went to up there. You know why I don't like that side of town, don't no. you? Why, because it's too high? Because it's gentrified. Let's put it that way. Oh, and my God. I remember when we used to go back there in that area, it it was like, you know, kind of like low income. And uh, not a the goddamn pet room and take up half the building and shit. Right. Like all the little coffee houses and the ice cream shops and stuff that used to be there are gone. And but I don't know. I just I would have preferred to be in my neck of woods, the woods, so see. And uh, also, like I said, I would have preferred to go to the original one. And uh, that's uh, you know that other place I told you that I wanted to try. Mm -hmm. that does the same thing I don't necessarily have to go to the Kelly Deuce again but I'm sorry I messed up your experience with 12th Street because I mean you could go to 12th Street and go check it out well 
if the food is going to be the same because you know every you know that's that's the goal of the restaurant to have the same food across the band you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. you over there like that yeah i know i've been in the food industry for a while I know, because y'all McDonald's wasn't like the one down the street. But, like, but even when I work now, Soul Man's, no Soul Man's is the same. No shit, because I went by Soul Man's the other day and wanted to go there. Thank you. I do my best, you know. It wasn't your Soul Man's. It was across the lake. <laughs> it wasn't your Soul Man's. It was across the lake. That's the Soul Man's I'm going to go to. They're just like... Cause you don't like ghetto ratchet or something? What? Like, you don't like ghetto ratchet or something? I love my ghettos. What you talking about? Well, you, you should know. We, we serve the best food since 1970. No, y'all don't. I don't think y'all step up and... We deliver now. Nah. Deliver like that. Well... Okay, and here's another thing. Think about this way. The La Calle Dos that, I, I, uh, that we went to. Uh, it's like, did they ever charge you the tip? Not yet. Anyways, um, no shit, cause they won't cash. I love the I love the thing when they ask, "Oh, tip is your discretion." I'll be putting negative tips. Anyways. No, I tip. Our waitress was was excellent, regardless. Right. She took a little she too long. Her tip. How much she took? Yeah. Why you gonna give it to us? No, nah, no, nah, I just wanna know. None of your business. I, I like to tell people twenty dollars for me, yo, me, so? I have to see. So next no, time you're coming to no, Souls, her, her service to my not souls, mediocre. I I expect nah, them to give me a tip too. So you saying I'm gonna sit at the table and you are gonna bring me my plate to me? Well, I'm gonna that I can order from the table. I'm gonna do that I can order from the table. I'm gonna do that regardless because you might. That's dad. not what I asked you. Yes. If I go there and you're not working, I can order from the table. You better treat you the same way. Mm, we gonna things. see. Like I tell them. People don't work in the morning. I don't know this. I know it's. Like I tell them. Anyways, as I, I was saying. That's probably what it is. Roll out the way you Because that's all you like that. Because I am one of the only. Well, me and me and L is the only two of the of that dying breed of old gins that work. There. Would you want to go to a cafe du Monde that was on Claiborne and Cafe? I don't know that's that. Wait, ain't that old about all Bishop Arts? That's like I looked at you <laughs> like you looked at me when I pulled that quote back up. <laughs> <laughs> that's the same thing I'm trying to explain about wow. where we what happened today. Look, we was getting ready to leave, right? And we had, you know, because I had some. I said, y'all can bag this up because I brought it on my son, you know. And uh, and yeah, she was yeah. like, you know, you want the bag? Like, yeah, go ahead, you know. I got the bag, right? I got the bag when it was time for us to leave. You know, like this. I don't care for them. Oh, anyway, that's because you burnt it. When it was time burnt. for us to no. leave. No, wait, wait, hold up, y'all. The woman, and this is why she earned her tip. I saw other servers bringing containers to the table. She brought ours, even though I didn't really trust that, to the right. back, <laughs> and, and did it for us herself. Because even though our stuff was, you know, it had been on the table, my stuff was still smoking hot. You know, because it was on, what is it, a plant chip or something? I don't know what they had that shit on. But anyway, when when I got them oysters and I ain't care for them, she wouldn't even let me eat no more. She was right, like, she don't even, don't, don't eat, don't eat that. Because they like them too. Don't eat them either. Yeah. And I wouldn't say the name, but her job might be mad that I see that. Right. But she was like, yeah, she was, she was good. She was a good waitress, you know. You know, sometimes you get them waitresses that, uh, when you go to uh different uh restaurants or whatever, you get some waitresses 
All waiters that say they don't speak English, or if they do speak English, they just got a nasty attitude. She did not have none of that. She didn't have none of that at all. At all. Because when I told her, I was like, these oysters, they're not fresh enough. You know, I I'm just wasn't like, impressed with the food, but like, bitch, the I'm service eating this raw. was impeccable. It was impeccable. And you going to bring me this crap? And so when I told her, I was like, these oysters ain't, ain't, ain't doing it for me. And uh, she had to know because I took one and I was like, oh, my God. And I said, Keisha, here, take one. Keisha like, no, no, no. I say, bitch, try it. <laughs> and uh, give you the uh, was not good. <laughs> then when she came by, we were, and she had to be watching us try it, cause it's like she came right, like right, right then and there, like, like I'm like, <laughs> you be crazy. I was mm. on Instagram, and they got to on Instagram was Frank. <laughs> that have been fun, yeah. <laughs> We working at Cali like, like, today. Mm. We chicken people with fake oysters. No, they weren't fake. They well, were bad. They were bad. Well, they were, they were like bad oysters there. You yeah. ever been in Fiesta and you go to the back, you be like, I'm going to get me some shrimp. But as you go into the walls of the back, you be like, I don't think I want no shrimp today. That's, that's how, how, that how them was. oysters grab. That's how that was. <laughs> that day when we went to that store and I went to go get me some uh, some uh, pork tail, pork pig feet, whatever, mm -hmm. and that smell just was like, oh, I'm like, you oh, talking about the market God, down? God, yeah. Okay. I'm like, baby, baby, no. Uh -uh. I said, I'm gonna be in the front, and I, I knew she couldn't take it because it was like I wasn't in the front. Like maybe I wasn't in the front two minutes, and she was coming right behind me. I'm like, mm mm, because man, I'm telling you, it's like you don't smell it. You didn't smell it in the front. You didn't smell it. Yes, you did. I didn't smell it in the front. I smelled as soon as we walked in the store. Yeah, and then my nose must have was turned off because I did not smell that till I got right in that aisle where we was looking at the seasoning. No, when we when we first went to the store, I was like, "Wow, what's that?" And uh, I was like, "Wow, what's that?" Gas station about water. At the gas station, you gonna shut up the gas station? What you gonna yeah, say yeah, out there? Yeah. Okay. yeah. Do that, do that. Do that. Well, shut up. Bitch, when I come over there, you right. better be do wopping then. Right. No, I'll be out there doing the tissue roll. I'm like, not so pretty. Need a little for you. Anyways, as I was saying. Shut up. Once we got up there. Who you leaving with? Be safe, baby. Huh? Who you leaving with? Okay. Be careful, be safe, baby. Let it learn. I just need to know who to kill. Right. Anyways, he gonna make us kill Pookie for nothing. Because that motherfucker knew he ain't leaving with no Pookie. Oh, my. I didn't say, uh. Oh, well. Well, you won't restart no, this video? No. Well, it's already ate. Well. He wants us to un, uh, just do some unjust stuff to the wrong talk. Yeah, because yeah, yeah. I know he lying. I know he lying. Pookie mm -hmm. was out there. I know there's another one. Um, so he said, "Hey, why you jumping out one car to another? Nah, wrong, wrong brother, wrong brother." So that one Pookie. Look alike. See. <laughs> Ah, they fed they dog. Yeah, that's true. No, that ain't what I wanted, Didn't but I'll take that. that. All right, thank you. Yeah. So, uh, anyways, we in this nice establishment. They brought us our leftovers in a bag, and uh, this motherfucker. Leans up and pulls the Kroger bag from behind her. She didn't even get to open it. If you would have seen how I looked at her, I was like, Bitch, if you don't put that she shit up. At, she <laughs> looked at me like my grandma looked at us when we was kids and we embarrassed her. You hear me? Like, just girl, put that up. Just put that up. Look at that. 
I'm like, oh wow, that that was a look. That was a real <laughs> look. <laughs> Cause I couldn't believe you did that shit. I was like, wow. Yeah, but you know, it was like you know, it was like everything that we wanted. They were, you know, she was, you know, fixing it for. Us. I mean, doing it for us or whatever. Because you know, like when you see people in a power chair. Oh, they handicapped. They can't do stuff. They can't. I'm like, I'm doing all this. I'm like, do I see our hands, you know? And what I be sure, you know what I'm saying? You know? I will say their service was you know, impeccable. That service was Because really they was impeccable. watching us oh come, God, come, yeah. come in there. They came it open was, the doors and everything. Was, yeah. So, uh. Boy, I think I'd have killed. You know what I mean? I'd have, I'd have killed them if I'd have got up. Everybody be surprised. They yeah, it's like when they like, see when they see you get up like Right. You can walk. How the fuck you think I got in this bitch? What, what, what? Wow. What? She helped me and mine and when I get my that bills together. You know, you know you know Did he eat to go run with his friends? Wow. He did eat. No he didn't. Yes he did. But he ate him, bro. He ate too. Uh-uh. Uh, he ate one raw and one with the ring. Well, not raw, but you know, one naked, you know. Man, I couldn't. Then, like I was saying, the reason, another reason, if we had went to the one that, you know, we knew things around it. What was around it? Fiesta. Had I known that, I'd have made that. But I just picked that one. Is, That's what I'm saying. I just pick one. I said my baby wanna go down the street from the chase that I go to when I go up that way. You know, by the Burger King and the Wendy's. Yeah, I just picked one. I said my baby wanna go to the Cali Dose. You know what? I'm gonna take my baby out. I'm gonna take her to the Cali Dose, and I just picked one. I did not think, you know, it would have been, you know. Okay, how about this? Think about this way then. If they we had a big daddies, if they had a big daddies on Skillman, would you go to that one or would you go to the one on Pine Street? I'll go to the one I know. We don't know either. We don't know nothing about either of them. We don't know nothing about uh, the right. Kelly Dose. But we don't know just, nothing about either one of them. Just so sit down and one. think about the area that the, the places is in. Would you go to that area for soul food? No. But well, why would you go for Mexican food? <laughs> I'm just saying. Right, right, right. Do, yeah, whatever. Do, uh, and you want to know the crazy part? I was about to say on Gaston, but Gaston is the, the, like St. Charles over there. You know how St. Charles is D Street? But you go turn a, turn a cone there and you be like, what the fuck? Mm-hmm. <laughs> be like, this ain't for us over here. We's the tourists over here. We needs to turn back around and it goes back to St. Charles. That's, that's how Gaston is. You ain't never really paid attention when your mama go to the doctor? Do you know two blocks down from her doctor's office is a family dollar? And let's be real. How many family dollars have you seen in good areas? No, that's three blocks down. No, it's two. It is three blocks down. From my doctor's office or from Aldi? From Aldi's. Okay, say that from Aldi, cause that's some that's ways down from my doctor's office. I'm talking about the general area. Then. How about that, okay, man? I cannot that. general area. Say that. The doctors, I go, I mean, well, I go ahead by my doctor is gentrified too, but you still go there. All deep, around now, you gentrified or whatever, but you still go there. Uh, but there's all these in the hood. 
And all these is cheap. <laughs> And for all the shit you talk, they still have a high homeless population over there. So I, I know, you know, what's going on over there. You know, they're not hoity toity. So are you taking yourself on 12th Street or what? Will I go to 12th Street? Mm -hmm. hmm. I don't know because now I'm going to be skeptical. I'm going to be like, hey, want to go ahead on and check me an oyster and let me see it. Before I order what I want, then they're gonna be like, "What?" Well, you know what they're gonna be like. And uh, I was just gonna find a, a new Mary School. Is that how they call it? Mariscos. Mariscos. I was just gonna find a new one. Uh, you know, the other day when we was on Buckner. You know the one I showed you on my phone? They got one on Buckner too. Okay. I was like, man, we go back that way. We could stop, we could chill, but you know, we had already fucked up at, at uh, the Wiener house. That was good. Why don't they have any steak and shakes down this way? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Right, right, right. That was you I was talking to about that? What? Because well, that building color is like steak well, and shake. When y'all can't pick me up from work. No, no, no. Oh, no, no, that was me. No, that was me and well, Dwayne talking right here. Right here talking about, about that could be a steak and shake because yeah, that's yeah. steak and shake yeah. colors and yeah. whatever. No, I and I, ain't none I, I of the steak and shakes are big. Yeah. You ever seen a big steak and mm -mm. Right. I don't care what nobody say. Steak and shake fries are the best. Okay. Fuck McDonald's fries. Steak and shake fries are the best. They don't do the garlic fries no more, so. They don't? No. Oh. But they plain fries are good. They plain fries are good. Yeah, you tripping. Like garlic fries, and you know what's the messed up part about that shit? Mm -hmm. They can make the garlic fries because they still got the bun. They still put that stuff on the bun. Right. So if they wanted to, they could do the fries. That's probably something you got to ask. I know because last time we went, old boy, I was yeah, like, yeah. we can make them for you. But that too small though, right. Yeah, yeah. And with that being said, we hope y'all enjoyed this video. We love y'all. Y'all take care. Be blessed. Have a wonderful, wonderful week. Thank you for coming and watching and rocking with us. And shape. until next time, we're going to plant you down and dig you later. Because I know y'all can pick up what we are putting out here. Peace, y'all.